right, guys. It is Awesome Grim. With the Gamer's Grim. And we are doing our 2024 playthrough of Fallout New Vegas. We are picking up right where we left off in the last episode. Uh, we had just uh, killed the Boomers in uh, Good Springs. Everybody survived. And uh, we got the XP. I don't think that there's really much else we can do in Good Springs. Uh, we got the safe out of the... Uh, we opened the safe in the schoolhouse. Uh, so I think it's time to start heading down the road and uh, finding our way to... Uh, I believe it's called Nipton. Or Novak. Can't remember. Prim. Hell, I don't know. We're going to go in any case. Take me a drink. Yeah. Let's head out. Where do we need to go from here? Yeah, I believe that's Prim. Yeah, that's where the next like set of uh, quests are. So let's head towards Prim. wonder if there's any other things to pick up around this town before we go. We'll come back if we have to. So we're going to head down the road and uh, continue playing. We did it. Do we have anything... I guess we're just going to rock what we have. Give me a perception. Yeah, we'll do that. I can already see uh, Prim on the horizon there. Oh, I see a crate. Broken. Nothing in there. <clears throat> oh, yeah, I think there's bad guys over here. If I remember correctly. that up there okay we can fast travel nothing in there can we go in here door to Gene Sky High that's skydiving Empty Sunset Sarsaparilla. Some lockers. Police batons. Oh, we're not going to pick that up. Nope. Okay. That guy's just hanging out right there. Brained him. <coughs> we'll pick up his goodies. I've got to remember what buttons do what. I keep doing. Like that? Down he goes. And we leveled up. Got our skill points. So we're definitely going to level up medicine. Definitely going to level up. Hmm. 
15 points. I thought I got more because I went at the full 10, but maybe you didn't, maybe you're not supposed to go the full 10. Could have messed that up. It's been a long time. So we should probably put those, that into there and yeah, we're going to go ahead and put it into the lock picking. That stuff comes in real, real handy. And then the next time we level up, we will uh, probably put some more points into science so that we can hack things more efficiently. I, I, I got to remember that you can now see if something's in there. You might be able to do some sneaky sneaks. <laughs> Sometimes I want to pick these up, but they weigh quite a bit. Whoa! I knew there was some dumb shit over here. Oh, yeah, here we go. Take that, because that is good money. What the hell? Bad karma. Oh, I hate that. Let's take some NCR money. We'll take the bullets, though. Really? This is stealing. I forgot that the karma situation in this game can be such a pain in the ass. Oh, that's so sensitive. save because uh, we know for a fact that uh, whoa, that's radiation know for a fact that if you don't save and save often you'll have a bad day A fight up here. I'll wait till you get close enough. Come on, where are you at? What the hell is this guy doing? And 
know that the bad guys. Hey, where the hell do you think you're going? Prim is off limits. What's going on in Prim? Some convicts from the prison up the road have taken over the town. Everyone inside is either dead or in hiding. What's more, there are two tribes of raiders causing trouble in this area as well. You'd be safer heading back up to Good Springs. We'd love to, but they don't fall under NCR jurisdiction. Even if they did, we're in no shape to protect them. We don't have the equipment to take out the convicts. And even if we did, we need some extra hands for backup. You should talk to Lieutenant Hayes. He's in a tent down the road. Just stay on the west side of the overpass if you don't want to get shot. Oh, yeah, it's red. You wouldn't take any more bad karma. Controlling the Mojave almost makes you wish for a nuclear winner. <coughs> oh goodness, it's already starting. Oh, well, oh, this is the wrong tent. I'm Lieutenant Hayes of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. What's your business? We were sent out here to hold back the tide of convicts from the correctional facility. As you can probably tell, we aren't doing the kind of job we could be doing. The mission isn't a problem. The problem is with supplies. Convicts are better armed and organized than our intel initially suggested. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to get some reinforcements here, maybe some guns with some firepower, but shit. Things are just going slow. Most people just call it NCRCF. That's NCR Correctional Facility. A little bit ago, the convicts there staged a coup. Killed the guards that weren't able to escape. And have been ransacking the area since then. Not much. They've taken to calling themselves powder gangers. Mostly because they've taken to using the explosives meant to clear boulders as weapons. They got organized faster than I would have thought. Most of them, at least. Thankfully, the small group in town here seemed to split off from the main force, so they aren't getting anything in the way of support. I have some... Right. Sir? Doesn't have anything to tell me. So it doesn't give me a quest. I thought maybe I would get a quest here. Inquire about your delivery assignment, and you have to so wonder. We won't go quite. Let's go through this one more time, maybe. Yeah. We we're. Mission isn't a problem. The problem is, I'm trying to get. I uh, bet if I, yeah, I think I remember. I some... Sir. I think what you have to do is you have to. <clears throat> so. Do I go just go over there? Not sure you should be here.
Didn't do so hot. I need to make my way down to the one place, I believe. <coughs> hmm. If I remember correctly, when I get high enough level, I can use just straight scrap scrap metal to repair things. Oh yeah, yeah, you get the question here. This is where the people who are holed up at. I don't know what it was brought you to Prim, youngster, but you might want to rethink your plans. Town's gone to hell. Johnson Nash is my name. Husband to Ruby now. Lived in Prim going on eight years now, thick and thin. I'm a trader primarily, for what it's worth with things like they are. I also run the local Mojave Express outpost. Well, I don't got any work right now, so I'd say. I'll tell you whatever I can. If you have a delivery order, you can show me. Oh, you're talking about one of them packages. That job had strange written all over, but we couldn't turn down the caps. That cowboy robot had us hire six couriers. Each was carrying something a little different. A pair of dice, chess piece, that kind of stuff. Last word I have in the office, it looked like payment had been received for the other five jobs. Guess it was just your chip that didn't make it. First deadbeat we hired to do the job canceled. Hope a storm from the divide skins him alive. Well, that's where you came in. Yeah, I got this look when he saw you next down on the courier list. His expression turned right around. Asked me if your name was for real. I said, sure as lack of rain, you were still kicking. Then he turned down the job, just like that. I asked if he was sure it was good money. No, but Courier 6 carried the package. That's what he said. Like the Mojave <laughs> sent you out or something. Then he just up and walked out. Well, now that you mentioned it, a few nights back, one of the townies was out scavenging for supplies. He said he saw a fellow with a daisy suit come through with some of them great con misfits. They was talking about a chip. Well, for that, your best bet is going to be talking to Deputy Big. Since they came to town, he was keeping a good bit of notes on them, and he was slinking around Bison Steve when your pretty boy friend came through. He may have heard where they were going. I guess I don't have anywhere mm -hmm. better to be. A beagle has some. Yeah, beagle. Right now, beagle is the closest Prim's got to any organized law. Mm -hmm. But he's still stuck up in Bison Steve. First thing I'd say is get his sorry butt out of there. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Oh, yeah, we can sell. Yeah. Get those caps back up. Mm 
boy, it's so sensitive. Killing us. Well, that is just loud, isn't it? Mm. Need to sell off some of this stuff. Weapons repair kit. Did I just repair it? Yeah, it's repaired. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Um, so we're going to go save Numb Nuts from the casino. What is our current locksmith? It'll be 47. We may not have enough to open that safe up. I think you need at least a 50. Could be wrong, though. I could be wrong, though. Oh, come on.
out. We should be doing some sneaking. I wonder. Seventy five. Good Lord. Yeah, that's pretty high. So let's go through here. What can we get? Anything worth taking here? Bunch of empty bottles. And there's anything in this box? Yeah, money. Money to be had. It has to be 75. Oop. Oop. Yeah, that's why that first perk you get is so good. That's right. What the hell? Take all your goodies. <laughs> did, did he? <laughs> that's super heavy, but that's got worth a lot of money. Not had enough, but we'll see what happens now. Oh! Face. guy we got to talk to. I don't suppose you came. Why, yes, I am. Yeah. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm in a bit of a predicament here. I'd be most of... <clears throat> Indeed, I do, good sir. And I would be thrilled to share that information with you as soon as I am released from captivity. No need to rush on my account. I lost feeling in my hands and legs out. Yeah, I don't want dumbass to die. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish clearing out all these dipshits and come back and rescue him. See, that one goes outside. 
that, does that really go outside? Hold on. Yeah, I know how to do lock picks. Cola, we'll take it. We'll take it. yet oh hey there buddy oh oh Thing good. Oh, sun says sarsaparilla. Mmm. Toilet whiskey. Delish. Ah, uh, let's see. Hello, big guy. Come on. I heard a door open. Hello, fellas. Oh. <laughs> kind of. Uh-oh. Wow, he's, he's coming in anime style. Good Lord. Did not work for him, though. Some purified water. Let our AP. Hey, there you go. Point blank. I do like that. Did that guy kill himself? Did I miss something? Ooh, somebody shot at me. Where are you at? It's going poorly for you guys today. Very sensitive. Very, very sensitive. Hmm. Empty sunset sarsaparilla bottle. If 
you are money. We'll take that. Money, money. Pretty more money. Goodness. My sinuses are going crazy today, so I am mouth breathing so hard. That goes out to Prim. I believe there is a guy out there that I do have to kill. It's a ransom note. Okay. That's another go. I'll take that. And some psycho. All right. So, still got people to kill in here. Now, I wonder, is this the way up here? Whoop. over there. Got a bobby pin. Lots of stuff. Lots and lots of goodies in there. I'm going. Sunset Sarsaparilla. You are crippled. Use a stim pack or sleep. We'll use a stim pack. average um, all right so I think maybe you can use a doctor's bag yeah yeah that's how that works I don't think there's anything else I can do on the third floor it looks like I gotta just go down So, I do believe we have to go outside. And if we do that, well, there should be some dumbass on the, uh, on the roller coaster, I believe. At least I think there is. Memory serves.
and there's another one over there. That's going to be a problem. I have an idea. It'd be quicker. Let's just do this, yeah. Fast travel to the front of the casino. Homeboy doesn't even know that he's by himself now. He's just standing over there doing stuff. just about cover it for uh, killing off the powder gangers here in the casino. <coughs> yeah, I believe so. Could be wrong. We'll go over and chat with Deputy Deagle. It would be so big. Oh, that's just marvelous. I think I'll be making. Oh, that's so gracious of you to... I feel like uh, I got them all. I'm just saying. They're sneaking really for no reason. You never know, I might be wrong. What's this over here? That's hard. Alright, let's go. Two of seven. Alright, let's get these brackets. Is this bracket? Well. Bracket over here. The bracket there. Bracket there. Bracket there. Alright, so leading has two, so I'm assuming that, uh, are there any other L's leaving? That's L and E. So, leaving has two, so... Nope.
Ugh, so stupid. I'm gonna go finish this quest. Howdy. Well, that was quite an a breaking myself out of a hostage situation. Not to diminish your role in it, of course, but it was quite thrilling. Problem is, there's still no law in Prim. What are we to do the next time ruffians menace us and hold us hostage? Oh, no. I'm just a deputy, and I can't be a deputy without a sheriff. It's called chain of command. It should be someone brave like you, but more of a homebody. Someone who'll settle down and watch over us. I heard the powder gangers talking about someone in the prison named Myers who has some experience as a sheriff. He may be a good choice. Also, with the NCR so close by, you may be able to get them to take over the town. Not sure why they haven't helped out already. You will? That's just marvelous. I'll start thinking up questions for the interview. The sheriff that was incarcerated up at NCRCF may be a good choice. You also may be able to convince that NCR guy across the road to take the town under his wing. Although martial law doesn't sound so fun. Uh-huh. Let's see. Oh, I gotta have him like way higher. Duh! I wasn't even reading the, the thing, I was just hitting buttons. Alright, let's go talk to the NCR guys. Because he's gonna send me down to the next town, which is where I need to be headed anyway, so I can sell and do that sort of thing. Woo! Hey, I liberated Prim! Now I gotta find him a sheriff. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah. We know Prim is a great strategic point, and we aren't blind to the needs of the town, but we're barely holding our own. We don't have the guns or the personnel needed to carry out our mission, much less take on... Yeah, but I already killed all of them. They're gone. What we need more than anything is... If we had just one more squad, we could easily install a sheriff and still handle our primary objective of protecting the interstate south of here. If you'd like to see the NCR include protection of Prim and its duties, then you'll have to get some more troops up here. Night at Mojave Outpost may be able to help. Sir. All right. So that's what we're going to do now. We're going to head to the uh, Mojave Outpost. But I think we've been playing now for uh, quite a while. So what we're going to do is we're going to save over here and uh, that's where we're going to call it for this episode. We're going to go ahead and save. So yeah, that's where we're going to call it for this particular episode. When we get back, we'll headed uh, towards the Mojave CR thingamabobber place so that we can Prim Ajera. So we will see you next time. Uh